Today we're going to talk about what is a database administrator. I, I attend a lot of conferences and meetings uh, when people ask me. I, I introduce myself. I say I'm a SQL Server consultant or uh, I'm a database administrator. Both are true. And the inevitable follow-up question is, oh, okay, so what does a database administrator do? I had someone ask me yesterday, oh, okay, what could you do for me? Somehow that question is always hard to answer. Um, okay, consider programmers for a minute, right? If someone meets, uh, if someone you meet tells you they're a programmer, you, you kind of have a good idea of what they do. Um, they write programs. It's a thing that runs on a computer, and it does something. A database, though, it's it's this thing somewhere out on some computer somewhere that holds data. Um, it doesn't even sound like it does anything. So you know that sounds easy. Why would I need an entire a person whose entire career is that? Well. A database isn't just a, a folder sitting out there on your computer collecting customer order files. It's a highly secure, highly configurable, and high transaction program, what we call uh, a service on your computer, that stores data and makes it quickly accessible to you know, people and programs that have the right permissions. I specialize, specialize in uh, Microsoft's database platform, Microsoft SQL Server. Um, and that comes with not only the database itself, but big segments for high-end reporting, data warehousing and analytics. Microsoft has put together an absolutely outstanding enterprise-level database platform to do just that, to take care of your data. And now all you need is an outstanding enterprise-level professional, like me, uh, to make sure that the platform runs the way it's supposed to, faster and better and more secure. Um, that's kind of all I had to say about it today. Um, that's a little bit of what I do. If you'd like to know more, please visit MidnightSQL.com and, uh, and take a look at some of the articles and contact me.